Hello, good morning, um, and a very warm welcome to the MPA's Health and Safety Conference and Awards 2019. Now, this award scheme is now in its 47th year, which is quite an achievement in itself. And this year, more than 140 entries were received from MPA member companies, large and small, from all corners of the UK and from all sectors of the industry. Now, just to remind you, there are eight core health and safety award categories to be presented, and here they are. So those are those eight. Uh, after we've dealt with those, we will turn to the individual recognition awards and the MPA special awards for those who have gone above and beyond in health and safety practice and performance. And then finally, we'll present the two big prizes, the Sir Frank Davis Trophy sponsored by 3M and the John Crabb Trophy sponsored by Aveta and more on those a little later. Now, first up is the Euro Bitume UK Trophy sponsored by Eurobitume UK for bitumen asphalt and contract servicing. And the winner is FM Conway. <laughs> On now to the worker involvement category, the TUC trophy sponsored by LKAB Minerals. And the winner in this category is Tarmac. Congratulations. <laughs> so the third of our awards is the Blue Circle Trophy for Transport, sponsored by John Brooks TMR. And the uh, winner in this category is Marshalls. <laughs> Now to the uh, Occupational Health and Wellbeing and the Wimpy Minerals Trophy Award. And the winner is Hansen. <laughs> we move on now to the Contractors Safety Award with the Back Me Trophy sponsored by Mentor Training. The judges decided that there was one outstanding entry in this category. Congratulations to Tarmac if uh, representatives, one or more, would like to come up and receive the award. <laughs> now, we, uh, we come to engineering initiatives and the award of the MPA trophy sponsored by High Control and the winner is Terex. <laughs> Next up is the TFL trophy for reducing occupational road risk, which is sponsored by EPC UK. And the winner in that category is Aggregate Industries. <laughs> So we come to behavioural safety, uh, safety culture and leadership management for the MPQC trophy, sponsored by MPQC. And the winner is Quinn Building Products. <laughs> We're going to move now from companies to individuals, um, those people who've made a big difference in their organisation and were named within the award submissions for their contribution. Darren Murray of GRS Building Products, Jerry Clancy of Quinn Building Products, Billy Benton of Hanson Aggregates, Josh West of SMTGB, Andy Holmes and Jason Ellis of Tarmac, Paul Nairn and Justin Welford of Aggregate Industries. And then, as you can see, a cast of thousands from Semex UK. Sonny Netto, Ronnie Simpson, Sam Shepard, Steve Taylor, Lee Needham, Paul Cheeseman, Stuart McRae, Callum McPhillips, and Jason Aikert, if you'd all like to come up as well. 
Well, now it's uh, time to present two MPA special awards. Uh, MPA is always looking across all of the award submissions for those um, simple, eye-catching ideas that can be used in a variety of situations. So the first for engineering goes to GRS Building Products for their bulk bag splitting initiative, which could be widely adopted across the industry. So please give them a round of applause as they come up to receive that particular award. Congratulations, gentlemen. And the second MPA Special Award for Behavioural Safety goes to Semex UK for their Safety Savvy Initiative. So if uh, Semex UK would like to come up in whichever shape or form, we have another award coming. We uh, come now to the Sir Frank Davies Trophy, named after the former chairman of the Health and Safety Commission and sponsored by 3M UK. Now this award is for outstanding practice and performance for those companies with fewer than 1,000 employees, recognising that when it comes to health and safety, size doesn't matter. The winner of the Sir Frank Davies Trophy for 2019 is O'Donovan Waste Disposal and receive your award. <laughs> Now, finally, it is uh, time to announce the winner of the John Crabb Trophy, sponsored by Aveta, recognising outstanding performance in health and safety. Winning this trophy means a company has demonstrated excellence across a broad range of areas, as well as meeting strict criteria for reported incident statistics. And the winner of the John Crabb Trophy for 2019 is Tarmac, who <laughs> received your award. <laughs> Well done to the team at Tarmac for their outstanding achievement and please at this point if you'd like to give a round of applause to not only uh, the winners that you've seen today but all those who've taken time to submit entries this year. Well done. I thought it was a fantastic day. Um, I also thought that the, the guest speakers were amazing and they, and they absolutely related to our safety journey. So um, wonderful day, we've got a great award as well, that, that always helps. Uh, for people engagement. Um, absolutely superb for me, I thought it was outstanding. Great event, uh, lots of innovations, lots of innovations that can be learned between the different industries. So yeah, really enjoyed it, well presented as well. I thought it was really good, really informative. It was good to hear some different opinions from different industries, uh, to see how we have similar sort of struggles. You know, we're all coming to that pinch point, I think, in terms of safety. But yeah, some really good uh, presentations and good awards. Yeah. Well, we're delighted to have been presented with the John Crabb Trophy by the MPA. Uh, this is for seven and a half thousand hard workers within Tarmac that uh, every day they come to work to make sure that uh, they work safe and they go home safe. So this is their reward. It's been a great achievement, but you know everybody's hard work has, has got to this point. So really, really pleased, really proud to pick the trophy up. Yeah, a lot of a lot of good information got out of it. A lot of the uh, awards, oh, sorry, a lot of the videos and presentations, absolutely brilliant. The initiatives and all the stuff that's gone on from the collective the groups, it's been really, really impressive. I certainly like you can take back. Another fantastic event. I can't believe that I'm saying it because every year it seems harder to, you know, match last year's standard, but we have made some changes and I think they've really paid off. The feedback we've had so far has been really very positive.